Gdish. Bachelor Ben dropped a bombshell last night. Let's make that two bombshells, actually, because he told two women that he loves them. Now, that is a cardinal sin on the show. The Bachelor is not supposed to say the L word until he puts a ring on it. So our Lauren Zima pressed Ben to find out what was he thinking. When this was going on, I, I loved two women, but now I'm happily in love with one, and that's going to stay that way for the rest of my life. That is so sweet of him to say. I mean, not, not that he's talking about me, but if he were, and maybe he is, I'm not going to say, you know, because, you know, I'm not allowed. But that is a sweet boy right there. I, like I said, I want to show her off. I want to date her well. I want to love on, love on her in public. I want people to see our relationship and see how well it's going. I'm not supposed to be here. I'm just, I'm just going to hide in the audience. I still have another week left on the show. What was your reaction to finding out that he said, I love you to two women, which is definitely going to get a lot of fans talking? I felt for the person that he didn't pick. He felt bad for one of us, you know, and he was just trying to protect her feelings. I don't blame him. I mean, I've been in love with two women. I've been to college, you know. <laughs> Shoshana's like, me too. If you had one moment that you could do over again from the show, what moment would that be? I, I think I would just would have shut my mouth in Mexico City with Amanda. I wish I hadn't glued my eye shot that one time because I did lose a few lashes. I guess I do have one regret and I, it's not, it's that, uh, that I didn't get things off my chest as soon as I felt them. Ooh, I wish I'd been a dentist. I kind of wish I'd had a twin. It's sort of sexy and also you don't need a job. And I also wish I hadn't eaten that burrito, <laughs> you know, because of uh, heartburn. What would you say to those people out there who have tweeted some of that stuff at you or messaged you on social media? Sticks and stones may break my bones, but words online will never hurt me. Ain't nothing gonna hurt me more than when I was in high school and they used to call me Molly the fucking idiot hockey. You know, that, that was hard. That wasn't easy. But it made me who I am today. Everybody has talked about how it would be great to see a black woman be a bachelorette, the bachelorette. Would you ever take on that role? Um, I don't think anyone would turn down that role. I would say no, probably not. It wouldn't be right, you know, because I'm pretty white. Whose team, if you had to pick, are you on? I am Team JoJo. I'm on Team Molly. Okay, SMH. SMH. So much right now. RN. What's the ETA on this marriage? You keep grilling me over and over, and you know I can't say anything. You make my life so difficult. You make me hold all this in, and finally tonight, it's time, right? It's time to, like, here in, in a week to uh, show this woman off. You're not talking about me. I mean, he might be. I'm not allowed to say. <laughs>